Hope you're having a wonderful Wednesday. Meteorologist Rebecca Sweet here. Now, while we are talking about what's happening here locally with the opportunity for some winter like weather, there's a couple different areas across the country feeling the impacts of old man winter. We do have winter storm warnings. In fact, some areas in the Dakotas looking at blizzard warnings in place with this blowing and drifting snow that is becoming a little bit more of an issue. And then you may be hearing the terms of bomb cyclone going across the far northwestern corner of the United States. That's this major system that's moving in, bringing in a lot of moisture coming in in the form of rain as well as some snow as well as some very gusty winds in place as well. We're going to be watching our area. Watch this low pressure system that's kind of pushing its way across the Great Lakes, continuing to churn as we go throughout the end of the work week. The question is, folks, how far south will some of this moisture go? Now, keep in mind, we are going to have this cold air in place. Will it make it far enough south to where we do get the chance? For some snow. Models are continuing to show a little bit more confidence in this. So basically snow to the east, snow to the west, the central plains fairly quiet right now. Although high temperatures today will be coming across as above average, we will continue to see much cooler weather returning as we go throughout the end of the work week. If you have any travel plans going into the weekend, temperatures for your Friday will be back into the 40s and 50s, warming up into the 60s and potentially into the 70s, especially if you travel a little bit further off to our west. If you notice Atlanta, Nashville, Smoky Mountains, even into Asheville, looking at temperatures into the 40s by the end of the week.